We're with Richard in Bramfontein in Johannesburg. Um, we've just launched a new Virgin Mobile flagship store. After that, we're popping up to the Branson Center of Entrepreneurship to meet some of the young entrepreneurs. We then go to lunch at Virgin Atlantic, and then we're on to One Young World, where Richard will meet Bob Galdorf, Kofi Annan, and various celebrities. It's going to be a brilliant day, and I think it really demonstrates the good that Virgin is doing in South Africa, particularly around entrepreneurship. The key challenges in South Africa right now, I believe, are around education as well as around unemployment. 50% of all of the profits made on our accessory sales go directly to the Branson Centre. I think every time you say Sir Richard's name, people in South Africa, all around South Africa, jump up and down. For us, obviously, it's all about communication and how do you put communication in their hands at an affordable price? And that is what Virgin Mobile is all about. What we're doing here at the Branson Centre is, a, is, a, is an amazing thing because we're able to come alongside young people who've got a business idea, are starting to get it off the ground. We really give them the business knowledge and skills that they need to grow and expand their businesses and put food on the table, create a livelihood um, and create jobs for the, for the many people out there that don't have that. Entrepreneurship is at the DNA of the Virgin brand. Virgin Atlantic recognises that. So we work with the Branson Centre to help get entrepreneurs to the UK, give them some international experience, and it's an ongoing project. The Virgin Group working in tandem with Virgin Unite can make a huge, huge difference to people's lives on a daily basis. The aim was to, and is still, to make a difference in people's life and just bring that positive change. So whatever it is that is extra beyond gym that we can do, you will find it here. My connection with South Africa goes back uh, many, many years since I was a teenager uh, when I first came here and um, experienced the horrors of apartheid. And it's just wonderful you know, the, the change that's happened over those years and South Africa has become united thanks to Nelson Mandela and Archbishop Tutu. People of my generation, you know, Richard, myself, etc., brought up with Mandela as a model, you know. Um, of course we're going to do whatever we can to, you know, help such a, a country that can produce people like Desmond Tutu, that can produce people like Nelson Mandela. The people want to proceed with peace and progress, but to do that, they have to deal with the unemployment problem above everything else, first and foremost. Richard has been very imaginative and creative, both in his business ideas and also on the kinds of activities he takes on. It's up to companies like Virgin to in invest in Africa. But the more investment they can get, the more we can get people out of poverty and, and get them to stand on their feet and be, be proud of themselves. Cheers. <laughs>